Rav Chaim Ozer Gudinsky, Allah Shalom, at his old age, it was very hard for him to walk. And he used to take very little baby steps going from his house to the yeshiva and back and forth. So he was going with his Talmud down the street. And a person approached him and he says, Oh, Rabbi, can you tell me how to get to so-and-so place? So the Rabbi said, Yet yeah, no problem. Let me walk you there. And again, the Rabbi was very fragile, very frail. He couldn't walk. It was hard for him to walk. Yet he went with the guy to show him the place. And he told him, Okay, here's the place. Now I'm going back. So the Talmud that was with the Rabbi told the Rabbi, Rabbi, what are you doing? You're old. You're frail, you're fragile, you're walking with a stick, with a walking stick, with a cane. Why? Just tell the guy, make a left, make a right, go straight, that's your place. Why did you have to walk with him all the way there? So the rabbi said, you didn't realize that he stuttered? You did not realize that this man stuttered? What would happen if I told him, make a right, make a left and go? He would obviously get lost, because it's very, you tell that, make a right, make a left and he forgets it two seconds later. So what would he do? He would go and ask somebody else, uh, 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 how do you get to that place? And every single time he has to stutter, he has to be embarrassed. So it's okay. I walk with him all the way there. Yes, it bothers me. Yes, it's painful for me. I'm an old man. I have a walking stick. I have a cane. Yes, I understand that. But the embarrassment that he will feel when he goes and he has to stutter every single time. Did you take that into consideration? Did you put that on your lib?